Hey guys, Dr. Dragon 902 here, and today I'm just going to show you a quick way to fill in an irregular shaped area such as this, and it just looks like this. Simply fill in the area. So yeah, let's get to how you do that. So as we saw before, it all has to do with the water bucket. And the way it works is you just use the fill command with replace. So you probably know how to use the fill command, but if you don't, you take one corner and the other corner of the area you want to fill with blocks, and then you type in the name of the block you want to fill it with, and then the ID of the blocks, in my case it would just be zero, and that would normally just fill in the area with blocks, but if you add the replace tag afterwards, and then the block you want to replace it with, then it'll replace it with that block, so if I do wool, and then I place water here, um, I got that backwards. This is the block that it replaces this block with. So it fills it with the wool replacing the water. So if I place water here, then just places a wool block on the water. So anyway, but to do this, you simply just, again, have the command where it fills a certain area water, zero, replace, water. So it replaces all, sorry, just had to cough there, but it replaces all water blocks with water. So any spaces of water, it puts water on it. The reason why it's filling up so fast is because I just used the command slash game rule, random tick speed, 100. I could even do a 1,000. So then, if I, if I clear it out here, and I place water, it fills up instantly. I could even do 10,000, and it'll fill up almost instantly with water. But anyway, I'll set this back down to 5. But, so the next command block you do, it's another fill command block with the exact same coordinates as it is in the first one. But... It, instead of replacing water with water, it replaces a red. It replaces the water with a redstone block. So it'll, and you can change the redstone block to any block you want. The commands will be in the description below. But it replaces all water with a block. In my case, redstone block. So it just simply fills in the irregular area with the block of your choice. And the final command block is just to reset it, replaces all redstone blocks in the area with air. But yeah, again, you have a command block to replace all water with water. So it just fills up the area with water. Then you have a command block to replace all that water with the block that you're choosing. And then you could have one to reset it just in case. So yeah, that's about it for being able to fill in irregular shapes with any block you want. But yeah, again, the commands will be in the description below. Um, if you like this video, then give it a like. It'll really help me out. And yeah, that's about it. So uh, yeah, see you guys.